Hey guys, it's Metro, and today, before you buy the Rumpel Blanket, make sure you watch this video. So I purchased this blanket, it's actually called the Original Puffy Blanket. I'm not really sure why they call it the original, I'm sure plenty of blankets have been made before this one actually came out, but I picked this up because my wife and I were actually going out to Cow Rock Mountain on the Appalachian Trail to catch the sunrise, and we knew it was going to be extremely cold. Alright, so it's Lolly and I hanging out here. Pretty cool. As you can see, we got a little rumple blanket staying warm in this chilly morning. About 30 degrees outside. So I picked this up for $99 and this weighs in at 2.1 pounds. Now they have a nano loft version that comes in at 1.8 pounds, but that runs you about $179 retail. So the installation is made of a 3D hollow synthetic siliconized fabric that keeps you somewhat warm. I would say it blocked the wind really well, but again at 2.1 pounds, this thing is pretty heavy. Now this is 100% recycled. Actually 60 bottles is actually what is required to make one of these blankets. And it's actually treated with a 910 DWR finish to make it water resistant and stain resistant. So with that being said, let's go ahead and open this up and show you what it looks like. All right, so with the rumple blanket outside, it's about 75 inches long and 52 inches wide. And it's been treated with a 910 DWR finish which makes it heavily water resistant and stain resistant, but if it does get dirty, all you have to do is throw it in the wash. And as far as the craftsmanship goes, I've already found a couple areas where it's got some flaws and so forth, but what I thought was unique was the fact that it has these paracord loops, as you can see here, which allows you to stake it down if you'd like. If you want to use it it's like a blanket for a picnic or so forth and put it on the ground. So one of the proprietary things that they have about this blanket is this clip, as you see here, but it's not very well designed. In fact, it only has a single stitch. But what you do is it actually connects to this loop here that has the little Rumpel logo on it. So as you can see, the clip here connects the two, and you can actually use this as a hands-free way to wear the blanket and huddle up. Now this is the one-person blanket. So again, weighing at 2.1 pounds, and being 75 inches long, 52 inches wide, it's also long enough to, to drape yourself over a couple chairs, especially if you're looking at the sunset. So after taking it up to Cow Rock Mountain on the Appalachian Trail, the temps were down in the low 30s, if not the high 20s. And after using it up there, I will say that it was kind of clunky in my bag. Again, with the stub sack, it doesn't really fit in there right. You can mount it to the outside kind of wonky as well so it does take up a lot of space within your pack so I don't think it's something that I'd be taking with me on any type of long distance hike but again this is a nice blanket for the money I think it would have probably been a lot better if it would have been around the $50 price point so with that being said is it worth it sure I wouldn't take it on any type of real camping trips or backpacking trips but for any type of car camping or just chilling out by the, the mountainside and so forth checking on the sunsets and so forth Sure, I think it's worth it at that standpoint. So if you found any value in this video, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and send me your comments as I do respond. As always, thanks for watching, but until next time, let's keep moving.